uh, musical kind. So. <laughs> so what, you want to start with the guitar thing or this okay. thing? Okay. This thing is a banjo. We've been having banjo week all week long. We're going. And if you're watching this on the internet, thank you for tuning in. We are Frank and Allie Lee, and I don't know where the camera is. <laughs> and we are in Mountain View, Arkansas at the Mountain View Meeting Place. And stick around. We're going to play you some nice old-time music for the next 45 minutes or so. And if you're watching the rebroadcast, thank you also. Make sure you comment where you're watching from. Is that, are we supposed to look up there now? No, no, we, no. Can we look at these people? We can people? look at these people. <laughs> right. We'll attend our live audience. <laughs> so you're probably going to get some comments from our cats. All right? Just want to warn you. They're vulgar. <laughs> back there okay. let's do the call and response thing one of many we do but this is called turn your radio on it goes come and listen in to the radio station where the mighty host of heaven sings turn your radio on turn your radio on turn your radio on if you want to hear the songs of Zion coming from the land of in the spring, get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And would you share? Turn your lights down low. Turn your lights down low. And listen to the Master's radio. Get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Listen to the glory land chorus, listen to the glad hosannas roll. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And get a little taste of joy awaiting. Get a little heaven in your soul. Get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And would you share? Turn your lights down low. Turn your lights down low. And listen to the master's radio. Get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Listen to the songs of the fathers and the mothers and the many friends who've gone before. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Some kind of morning we shall meet them. Over on the Hallelujah Shore, get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. And would you share? Turn your lights down low. Turn your lights down low. And listen to the Master's radio. Get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio on. Get in touch with God. Get in touch with God. Turn your radio. Thank you, everybody. Appreciate that. That's called Turn Your Radio On, written by the same fellow that wrote I'll Fly Away, Albert E. Broomley. That's right. Yeah, from, I think, Springfield area, right? Maybe or so. All right. <laughs> what you like to do now, babe? I'm up for anything. You want to freak them out really bad or just kind of bad? Kind of bad. It's yeah, good. Kind of yeah. bad. We have a lot of instruments to share with you. That was Frank's 1936 30 acoustic 36. guitar. Um, it's branded Carson Robeson. It was made by the Gibson Company. Carson Robeson was a country singer that got so big at the time, he got his own line of guitars. And this one was hot rodded. Uh, it was built with ladder braces inside, which was cheaper and quicker to do at the time. And uh, this fellow over in Mount Erie area named David Shepard took the inside all apart and made X braces, which makes the sound kind of have a more focused um, tone. So we love that guitar. You know, we got brand new strings <laughs> today on the fiddle. So it's a blessing and a value. <laughs> Becca put them on for me. She's got good eyes. 
to see those little tiny holes up there. So we're going to do a piece for you that we learned from Paul and Leon Kofer. And they were growing up in the eastern part of Georgia, middle part of Georgia down there, Sparta, Georgia. And it was two fellows that grew up on a turpentine farm where they were pulp, pulp, wood in middle Georgia. It's thick with pulp industry. So there were laborers working on that pulp farm in the 1920s and uh, earlier. And so these two guys, Paul and Leon Kofer, they learned all their music from these laborers who worked on their parents' turpentine farm, really. But And they did one called the Black Bottom Blues that uh, uh, is, is, is what, honestly, that Jerry Garcia put together a piece called the Deep Ellum Blues. Yeah. And he was a big fan of the, or is probably, I'm sure, still of uh, Paul and Leon Kofer. So here's their version of the Black Bottom Blues. You think we can get through these Sounds words? a little punk rock. Wow, that's some different strings there now. You ready? If you go well, down in black bottom, bottom, leave your money in, in your shoes. shoes. Well, them women in black bottom got them black bottom blues. Oh, sweet mama, daddy's got them black bottom blues. Yay! I think a lot of get job on behind us. Okay. Are you down with that? That sounds great. This is one we're going to play. It's called The Old Jawbone. <laughs> My wife died in Tennessee. My wife died in Tennessee, and they sent her old jawbone back to me. And I put her old jawbone on the fence, and ain't been back for to see it since. That's the chorus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's a real cheery He's number. He's hating it. <laughs> yeah, I missed my nap today teaching banjo lessons now. It's true. Um, this is going to make everything sound better. I get this accoutrement on here like this. <laughs> I think this comes from the Ozarks. Died in Tennessee, and sent her old jawbone back to me. And put the old jawbone on the fence, and ain't seen nothing but the jawbone since. Old jawbone, you better get along. In come Jenny with the big boots on. Old jawbone, you better get along. She took them off, and I put them on. Took them off and I put them on. Folks. 
<laughs> and we've only been married here for a few months. <laughs> we got married in September. We had a big hoe down up in Indiana, uh, where she's from. Anybody from Indiana that'll admit it? No. Allie was raised on a, this is Allie Lee over here on my left. She was raised on a, a corn soybean farm right downtown Indiana, I'm telling you for sure. <laughs> and we met up there in, in Indiana, up in the north and eastern corner, Angola. Anybody ever heard of Angola, Indiana? There is a prison up there. I was in car, she was a, she was a guard at the prison, and I was... Locked up for a little while, and we used to s sing through the bars. That's how we got started in the show business. You want to do the murder ballad? Or okay. So this is one about a real song here about little Sadie. It's a murder ballad. You ready? night to make a little round. I met little Sadie and I shot her down. Went back home, got into bed. 44 smoke was under my head. I got up the next morning about half past nine. The coaches and the buggies all awaiting in line. The pimps and the gamblers standing around. They're gonna carry little Sadie to the burying ground. said, yes, sir, but my name is Lee, and I shot little Sadie in the first degree, first degree or the second degree. Got any papers, won't you read them to me? And then it took me downtown and dressed me in black Had nobody for the gold mine bill. And then a judge and the jury they took the stand. The judge had the papers on his right hand. 41 days, 41 nights, 41 years to wear the ball and strike. And I went out last night to make a little round. I met little Sadie and I shot her down. Went back home, got into bed. 44 smoked the sun to my head. So we've had banjo week going on this week, and we started right off the bat playing little Cumberland Gap out of F position. F stands for fun, stands for Frank. <laughs> so we like Frailing. to start frailing. So we're going to do this next piece in the key of F. We learned it from Jim and Jesse McReynolds and all the Virginia boys in the band. Played this thing called She Left Me Standing on a Mountain. This was our theme song there for a little while. <laughs> long, long enough, though. Here we go. <laughs> Darling, will you marry me? I ask a maiden fair. Well, I turn my back upon her. I looked, she wasn't there. She left me standing, standing on a mountain. She left me standing way up there. Where the honeybees are buzzing round the flowers there. 
That is where she vanished, somewhere in that mountain air. She left me standing, standing on a mountain. She left me standing way up there. Talking to a bear, they were both a laughing about her giving me the air. She left me standing, standing on a mountain. She left me standing way up there. anything if once more she'd appear tell me that she cares a little for this mountaineer she left me standing standing on a mountain she left me standing way up there she left me standing standing on a mountain she left me standing way Yeah, our, we have our cheat sheets up here. They're organized by which instrument Frank plays. And uh, so there's one that says metal across the top. It's not like, ah! <laughs> it's like a metal guitar. Metal resonator, national, duolian, 1932 guitar. I bought it in the local music store there in Bryson City. It came in uh, from, a local, from a family there that was bought by Wallace. Swan, when it was new, in Whittier, North Carolina. So that's pretty fun stuff to know. And which one would you like to do? Let's do please? Can't Nobody Hide from God. All right, here's like one that, one that we learned from a fellow named Blind Willie Johnson, and he was from out in Texas. Blind Willie Johnson, and his music is on the spacecraft Voyager right now, flying through another galaxy on the way to a big party out there somewhere. They're going to play Blind Willie Johnson. And, and they... Anybody know what I'm talking about? Sure you do, yeah. everybody does. <laughs> Y'all need to inform me what all's going on with that. Today, I didn't catch up with it today, wherever they're at. <laughs> but sometime or another, they're gonna, the extraterrestrials are gonna run into this Blind Willie Johnson blues piece, not this one that we're gonna play. The one that's on the spacecraft is called uh, Dark Was the Night and Cold Was the Ground. That's the name of the piece. And uh, But this is another spiritual piece. Good. I did realize the day that the old bell cow is a spiritual piece in India. I'm sure, wouldn't you say so? <laughs> yes. I'm serious now. I need to respect that stuff. Okay. Can nobody hide? Can nobody hide? Oh, can nobody hide? Oh, can nobody hide? Can nobody hide? Can nobody hide? Can nobody hide? Oh, can nobody hide from God? You can hide from the devil, but you can't hide from God. Can nobody hide from God? You can hide from the devil, but you can't hide from God. Can nobody hide from God? Can nobody hide? Can nobody hide? Oh, can nobody hide? Can nobody hide? Can nobody hide from God? You can hide from the deacons, but you can't hide from God. Can't nobody hide from God. Oh, can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide. Oh, can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide. Oh, can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide. Oh, can't nobody hide from God.
can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide. Oh, can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide. Oh, can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide. Can't nobody hide from God. the furniture man this is a little story about some social awareness in the late 1920s they'd cut your cell phone off if you didn't keep your bill paid back then also (laughs) and this is about mr riley was a furniture man that on 16th street in atlanta that's where i was born and the 16th street's where all the hippies stayed back as i remember as a, a, a teenager so this song mentions 16th street and it's just what's, yeah, it's, uh, Mr. Riley's gonna come get your furniture if you don't keep your bill paid. And it goes like. Yeah, go tell that lone man. Oh, show is bad. Riley's wax has been here and he's got everything I had. Riley's been here and he's got my furniture and gone. Yeah, and Riley, he's a white man and he lived on 16th Street. Every Saturday evening, Mr. Riley, you would meet. Riley's been here, he's got my furniture and gone. He said, he told that old man driver, take down that rosewood bed. Riley's been here, he's got my furniture and gone. Yeah, it makes no difference, Mr. Riley, he's white as crystal snow. And if you don't pay Mr. Riley, he'll take your furniture to show. Riley's been here, he's got my furniture and gone. So go tell that lone man, oh, show's bad. Riley's wagon's been here, it's got everything I had. Riley's been here, he's got my furniture and gone. <laughs> We've got a, a recording out. It's called Roll on Clouds is the name of our album that came out in April. And um, this piece that we're about to play is on there, but because of the way the banjo gets tuned, we don't get to play it at every show. Uh, this banjo goes to a few different tunings, and this particular one's up a whole step from where all the other songs are. So uh, this is fun. We get to play this piece by Lead Belly, is who originated this song, made it kind of popular around America anyway. I remember right. I'd like to play some guitar for this one. Certainly. So Lead Belly wanted to get in on some of that country western music money back in the 1940s, and he wrote a piece called When I Was a Cowboy. <laughs> it's true. And so uh So this is kind of a farce on the cowboys, I think, that he put together, but it maybe not. Oh, that's right. This is another lead belly piece about trying not to, trying not to die on a on a on a, on a gallus pole. So they're gonna he's the fellow screaming, wanting somebody to come and pay his way, trade his way out from hanging by paying off the lynchman. So it was um, pr- from the British Isles. I'm pretty sure the old thing was, but it's made its way over here and was pertinent.
Son, I brought you all my silver. Son, I brought you all my gold. Son, I brought you a little everything to keep you from the gallows pole. What did you bring me to keep you from the gallows pole? What did you bring me to keep you from the gallows pole? on his 12-string guitar. It's really great stuff. Howie's going to play the banjo and sing one. I'm not sure which one he's going yeah. to sing that one. We were in our class, we were talking about the Coon Creek Girls. I, um, we were talking about Banjo Picking Girl and listened to a little bit of that, which is fun. And I believe this piece was done by that band also, White Top Mountain, okay. a.k.a. 44 Gun. Banjos are endlessly, we're having to deal with that tuning stuff. We have a gathering for old time music out in western North Carolina where we live. It's called the Banjo Fiddle Frolic, and it is exactly as much fun as it sounds. Um, it is frolicsome. We have a lot of good food, barbecue. Um, we have a lot of instructors, eight including us, and we have the opportunity for one on one lessons with all the instructors plus 11 workshops going on, plus a guided jam, so you can always choose your own adventure, uh, whatever appeals to you, you can kind of work with the schedule and uh, do your own thing. So it's only like 25 people, it's about the max, this lodge where we have uh, the event can hold. And we're sold out for this year, April 5th, um, and this will be our third one, looking at doing one in the fall. So if you uh, are curious or interested, Check out frankandallie.com and look, on, look for the frolic um, because we might be having one in November, looking like. And definitely another one next, next spring. Yeah. The lodge will hold more than 25 people, but the septic tank won't accommodate more than 25 <laughs> people. So it's, it's limiting the attendance to our event here, so we're going to try to have a benefit to... Put in a new septic system <laughs> so we can clear a little money on this deal. All right, White Top Mountain. Two, three, four. <laughs>
Thank you. What about um? What about my mom's favorite song that we play? Mm. You think we could pull that one off with the two guitars? I'm glad my wife's in Europe. Is that the one you're talking <laughs> about? <laughs> No. Oh. Cabin on a hill. The cabin on the hill. That sounds like a winner. <laughs> oh, I just married into a fine family now. Indiana oh. Hoosiers. I'm thinking it's what they are. <laughs> I hope there's is anybody here from Indiana. <laughs> we already asked that. Nobody's come in yet. It's a long way. They might be watching up there. It's rare <laughs> we get a, there, there's some Georgia folks in the audience, I think, man. This oh, rare yeah? we get a chance, especially for Georgia people. And we'll play just, I think, a few more of our favorites for you this evening, and then we're going to, like I said, circle up and play a little music. We've been playing a lot of banjos the last couple days, so we're excited to play guitars. <laughs> Banjo's great, don't get me wrong. Be fun to kick back a little bit. Play some uh, what you want to play. Right now? I know we're going to play Cabin on the Hill. Yeah. We've been doing this. We might have played when we were here last time. We were really sick a year ago. We had all kind of flus and stuff going on in, under the same roof. And uh, all we could do is lay around and watch old Flatten Scruggs videos for days and weeks, <laughs> it seems like. So we learned a lot of good stuff. And this is one called The Cabin on the Hill. There's a happy childhood home. There's a happy childhood home. In my memory, I can see. In my memory, I can see. Standing out upon a hill. Standing out upon the hill. Beneath the shadow of the tree. Beneath the shadow of the tree. And if I only had my way. Give my heart a thrill. It would give my heart a thrill. If I could simply, wander, wander, back, back. simply wander back to the cabin on the hill. To the cabin on the hill. Oh, I'd like to wander back to the cabin on the hill. To the cabin on the hill. Oh, I'd like to wander back to the cabin on the hill. To the cabin on the hill. Beneath the shadow of the tree. Beneath the shadow of the tree. I would like to linger still. I would like to linger still and just to be. With those I love, just to be with those I love. Joy my heart would overfill. Joy my heart would overfill. Just, just to simply wander back. back. Just to simply wander back to the cabin on a hill. Simply wander back to the cabin on a hill. Thank you. Well, we um, certainly it's a big joy and kind of an honor, really, also to get to come and teach and play in Mountain View, which is known nationwide for its music and for the people that come here to pick and the people that live here that are wonderful musicians. Um, so many wonderful roots and bluegrass and country and old time musicians that they have their own Arkansas Music Awards and they have great bands thanks to the Music Roots program that trains up kids. Um, so we're gonna invite our friend pretty soon in a little bit, Becca. She's gonna come and play uh, fiddle with us. Maybe a couple more songs. Um, but that'll be really fun. Anyway, it's just a real joy to be around so many people that love 
this kind of old music like we do and I that are wonderful players. I've been hearing of Mountain View for all my life or the place to be for folk music and uh, never got to come till last year. And it's a huge thrill to come up here and get to play. And this place is not like anywhere else you're going to find. It used to be like where we live in Bryson City, but that all changed and now there's tons of people, but that's good. They bring their money. And But you guys have a special thing going up here for sure in all the departments. Which one are we going to play again? Let's play the Carter family piece, Anchored in Love. One, two, three, one, two. I found a sweet haven of sunshine at last. And Jesus abiding above. His dear arms around me are loving me cast. As sweetly he tells his love. And Jesus the tempest forever. What rapture is mine The water's receding The danger is past My soul is so happy I'm anchored at last I'm anchored in love divine He saw me in danger And loving he came To pilot my stormy young soul Seeding the danger is past. My soul is so happy. I'm anchored at last. I'm anchored in love divine. Well, I'm anchored in love divine. Sorry. That's okay. Let's just do one more and then have Becca come up. Which that is sounds great. like Which something that'll get us cranked up. Yeah. Some hot fiddle playing. Yeah. So we're going to do one more before that happens? Yeah. Okay, what do you think it should be? Um, Don't offend anybody. Well, I think that metal guitar went over pretty well. Good deal. Okay. <laughs> well, we know some songs about Arkansas boys that we just know we shouldn't be singing here tonight. <laughs> but we do some shows over here in the next state. You might want to come hear some of this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I heard you in Missouri. <laughs> okay, there you go. You did. <laughs> shall we do? Well, uh, heck, honey, we got a lot of choices. We could do Hate the Train, we could do Somebody on Your Mom, we could do... Are there any lawyers in here tonight? <laughs> somebody on your bond. All right. Here's another Blind Willie Johnson piece called You're Gonna Need Somebody on Your Bond. <laughs> your bond you gotta need somebody on your bond when it's way in midnight Lord death comes slipping in your room you gotta need oh, somebody on your bond yeah when you was a gambler had no one to call your bond oh you fell on your knees and began to pray and asked Jesus to call your bond and you gotta need somebody on your bond you're gonna need somebody on your bond when it's way in midnight Lord, death comes slipping in your room you're gonna need oh, somebody on your bond When you was a drunkard, had no one to call your bond. Oh, 
Before you fell on your knees and began to pray and ask Jesus to go your farm. And you're gonna need somebody on your farm. You're gonna need somebody on your farm. When it's way in midnight, Lord, that comes slipping in your room. You're gonna need a whole somebody on your farm. And begin to pray and ask Jesus to go my bond. And now I got somebody on my bond. Now I got somebody on my bond. When it's way in the midnight, Lord, death comes slipping in your room. You're gonna need a whole somebody. serious banjo students this week and it's about wore me out now. I could have kept up with you years ago, I'm saying. <laughs> this is what we call a jam. We haven't played this before with Becca, I don't think. What key you want to be in? Oh, gee. <laughs> what you gonna play? This is Becca, and she lives in Mountain View. She's amazing.
children, don't you cry. Sail away, ladies, sail away. Y'all be angels in the by and by. Sail away, ladies, sail away. Don't she rock, daddy, oh, don't she rock, daddy, oh, don't she rock, daddy, oh. Sail away, ladies, sail away. Oh, now I got a letter from Shallow Town. Sail away, ladies, sail away. It said St. Louis is burning down. Sail away, ladies, sail away. You might not have heard because we didn't say it into the microphone. She built that fiddle. Yeah. She's 15. She built that fiddle. Yes. She's amazing. Yes. All right, so stick around. We've been Frank and Allie. Let's play some music. That'd be fun. You got them, you, you got get it out, and let's tune them up. Sounds fun. <laughs> <laughs> 